Joe Morton has more than 70 roles under his belt. Fans certainly know for his Emmy-winning work on the hit show Scandal as the calculating dead of a Washington crisis manager. Well, now Joe stars in Proof, playing a hospital administrator trying to raise money while handling a rebellious doctor. Joe Morton, good morning. Good morning. We'll good talk morning. about proof in just a moment, but first, for all the scandal fans like me out there, <laughs> what's the deal? Papa Pope's in jail now. He's yes. not going to stay in there for long, though, right? Well, who knows? I mean, first of all, we're talking about Shonda, so who knows yeah. what's going <laughs> to end up on the page. On the surface, you would think being in jail for embezzlement sounds like an easy thing for him yeah. to get out of, but sure. we'll see. I'm sure she has something wonderfully divisive to, you know. There's no chance you won't be back, though, right? Um, who knows? Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, no, no, I, I mean, I can't tell you one way or the other, but um, I would guess I'm coming back. Okay. What do you like about this character? What do I like about it? Yeah, because you have such, we were talking each about the films that we love. Al actually reenacted an entire scene from Speed. <laughs> um, what is it about this character in this show especially, too, that just really gets well, into Well, one, I've not usually played bad guys. Right. For most of my career, I've played good guys. And I, I always thought that if I did play a bad guy, he would have to have some real reason. Uh, and this guy has real reasons for what he does. One is to protect the Republic of the United States, and the other is to protect his daughter. Two things I think most people can identify with sure. to help the country and to help your, a noble your family. Villain. I think most villains, I don't care what they've done, believe themselves to be noble. I yeah. think that you can, well, as an actor, you can't play a negative anyway. You have to play a positive. And right. so I think most villains believe that they are their changing, uh, making their world or the world in general a better place to live. So tell us about Proof. This is a really fascinating mm -hmm. concept on T mm -hmm. coming up on TNT. Proof is about proving whether or not there's life after death, which is a question we ask ourselves all the time. Um, it's pitting science against belief. Now, the storyline is that Matthew Modine uh, plays a very wealthy but very ill man mm -hmm. who manages to talk Jennifer Beals, who's a heart surgeon, a very acerbic heart surgeon, who are very opinionated, into following uh, a, a number of files that he's accumulated over the years about near-death experiences. Now, she gets hooked because she's just lost her son, and she's also had a near-death experience. I play uh, a brain surgeon who's in charge of the um, surgical wing of the hospital, um, her boss, uh, J Jennifer's boss, but I know nothing about their quote unquote independent research. Ah. We actually had yeah, Matthew on a couple weeks ago, and yes. it was like the deepest segment we've ever had about the afterlife. Yes. And it's just oh, such a wow. fascinating premise. It is. I mean, when I went in to interview for the part, I basically told them a story, which I'll try to tell you quickly. Is um, actually, it's going to have to wait because we ha we've see? only got eight seconds. But <laughs> in the afterlife, you can tell us. I will. Oh. I'll come oh, back. No. Yes. And tell yes. You. Wow. Wow. Tomorrow night on TNT. <laughs> Hello, today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.